Good morning. Good morning. Today is day six. Six. Day six. <laughs> We're in skate kits. We're doing a uh, steel band and coastal cruise tour this morning or this afternoon. Mm-hmm. So uh, yeah. we're going to go down and get some breakfast at uh, Oceans, and mm -hmm. then we're going to uh, get ready and get off the boat, do a little shopping, and then do our excursion. And I want to try Starbucks. <laughs> <laughs> it's included in our drink package because we have the plus, so we get she's free Starbucks. Never had Starbucks before, and we've got nope. free on the board, so she's And I don't drink coffee. <laughs> trying her for Starbucks. <laughs> Something chocolatey, please. <laughs> Absolutely uh, going to have a wonderful time today. We're looking forward to it. Going to sunscreen up and hit the beach. So we'll take you with us and see what there is to see. We will. Co come along and escape with us to St. Kitts and Nevis. Escape. Escape. A little ocean for breakfast here. I've got a ham and cheese omelet with some breakfast potatoes. And we've got a little French toast to share. And Robin has an American breakfast with a scrambled egg sausage and a side of toast. <laughs> Any style. <laughs> this is the Starbucks on board, and we have the Drink Plus package, so our Starbucks is free. So I am having my first Starbucks, which is going to be a hot chocolate, because <laughs> I don't like coffee. But Steve got a peppermint mocha. We're going to have some Starbucks. Yippee! Oh, and they have great snacks over here, too. These little snackies here you can get. Oh, and salted potato chips. Interesting, slightly bizarre glass sculpture. It's extremely impressive the amount of time and work that it took to make this thing. St. Kitts got the Norwegian sun next to us. Sunny Harbor today. Coincide Norwegian Pearl. Looks like they're about the same size ship. Could be the same class. I haven't researched the sun yet. The Norwegian Sun and the Norwegian Pearl are very close in size, but the Sun is a smaller ship. When you compare the total tonnage of the ship to the number of passengers, or what we call the space ratio, the Sun has more space per person compared to the Pearl. This means that you might have a bit more space to yourself on the ship, although there still could be some crowded areas like buffets and pools, etc. The Chewy ship that's been traveling around with us. Uh, the Morelia, Morelia or Morella Voyager. Welcome to St. Kitts, a gem of the Caribbean. This enchanting island, part of the West Indies, boasts stunning landscapes from lush rainforest to pristine beaches. Dive into the crystal clear waters, explore vibrant coral reefs, or hike to the peak of an ancient volcano. St. Kitt's rich history comes alive in its charming colonial architecture and historic sites. Savor the island's flavors with fresh seafood and local delicacies. Discover the perfect blend of adventure and tranquility on the beautiful island of St. Kitt's. St. Kitt's sign, of course. Oh, we've already got a tour. Oh, no, thank you. Come on. I got bit by one of those ones. <laughs> it got me on the nose. Have a good one. Have a good one. Just a bit of a warning note here. The pressure of the people trying to book you on tours is harsh in this area. Please use a no thank you, a no, and then a no if you don't want to buy something from them. We've already got a plan, thanks. Piranha Joe's in every port. No. Got a plan, thank you. At this point, we decided to go ahead and head on over to our excursion. We wanted to do a little shopping, but the pressure was a little much for us this morning, so we opted out and we're gonna head right over to our place to wait in line for our excursion. 
We found our friends Roger and Christine in line for the excursion. We were excited to see they were coming along on the same one as we were. I hate fish. Pluck it off. <laughs> no, get my mole. Forever. <laughs> Dropped off at the beach. The videos we had seen online, the beach was a little less developed. Seems they've added some beach chairs and uh, and tents. And there's also a local bar and restaurant it seems here, and also a bunch of locals hanging out. So your stuff might or might not be secure here. Yeah. Here we are at the beach in Saint Kitts. Saint Kitts apparently it's not really it Nevis. Not really Nevis. Uh, hey. Some other people we met here who uh, paid uh, 15 bucks for a cab ride yeah. here. <laughs> we'll show you the beach. So. This is the beach on that side. And then we have this weird shed <laughs> selling beers. They were trying to get money from people in a big way. 10 bucks a chair. 10 bucks a chair. That's our boat out there and it'll come back and get us in a half hour. No place real put your stuff because the water comes up. To yeah, comes up to right here. <laughs> uh, so we got our stuff hanging up high, but uh, this is the beach. Obviously, they can't. You guys, if you guys want it, for, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Right next to us. <laughs> yeah. Karen already hit it. Hers, he's stuck. We'll burn him up. Right. <laughs> Drama as a toy for Christmas. It was one of the greatest. 
this innovators Go up. Here's the, the beach they drop you off at. The uh, In a lot of the videos we've seen, there weren't any chairs here. Obviously, the locals have a business where they put chairs down as soon as the people show up and then charge you 10 bucks a chair. There's a little bar here, buy uh, beers for three bucks a piece. And then they've got a little restaurant over here of some nature. But you can easily get here with a 25 minute cab ride for 15, 20 bucks. And they'll just bring you right here and then right back to the ship if you like, without having to do an $85 excursion to get here and then back. Roger and Christine for being on this excursion with us and uh, being so much fun. You made it so much better. So as we got off the ship, we were told we were very close to boarding time, so we hot-footed it to the ship. <laughs> we uh, had about eight minutes to spare, so we made it on time, but uh, we were definitely in a rush. Here we are in Indigo. We haven't uh, had dinner here yet. This is our first time having main dining this, uh, this cruise. 
excited for dinner. Really hungry. We haven't eaten since breakfast at Oshia's. At our long uh, excursion, we had a really good time. And uh, we've gotten back at around 4.30. We showered up and uh, had a one cocktail up top. And uh, now we're in dinner. So excited to bring it to you. We're going to show you what we get. And we're going to get a bunch of stuff. Because <laughs> we want to do a lot of appetizers. That's mostly the best stuff on the menu. Really pretty restaurant. Good evening. Ice water is fine for the table. Absolutely. Yes, please. All two of us. Yeah, all two of us. Just, Just the two. You can order as many as you want. Yes, please. Beautiful bread service here on our beautiful table. And I've broken some bread here. I'm preparing to butter it. <laughs> is that too detailed? Yay, pretty wine pool. <laughs> How do you say it? Ira. Thank you, Ira. <laughs> Got our first couple of appetizers. I got some coconut shrimp. And Robin got some cheese ravioli and a lobster bisque. Mm, look at that. That looks delicious. Mm -hmm. mm, I can't wait to try that. Look at all the olive oil around the edge. Mm. Hot fish. The next appetizer, we've got some avocado hummus. Just to try it. Never had it before. Figure I'd give it a shot. Robin, the next appetizer, she's got some French onion soup. Yet another appetizer. I've got the baked brie salad. So far, all of our appetizers have been very solid. We just got our mains here. We've got seafood paella with mussel, or actually clam, mussel, and calamari. And I think it's calip in there somewhere. I don't know where. And this is the shrimp fettuccine alfredo. Little shrimps this year. Hello, Norwegian. Little shrimps. And Steve got a nice good strip steak. Yeah, it's a real decent looking strip. We'll really see how well it's cooked, but it looks yeah. good. Looks good. Yeah. Nice medium. Mm -hmm. Good cut. Tastes good. And I got the Snickers pound cake and chocolate ice cream. <laughs> she asked me if I wanted two scoops. I said yes. I like ice cream, uh, but we'll uh, show you desserts in a sec. Our desserts have just arrived. This is the Snickers Pound Cake, and it has fresh strawberries over here, which are fresh, but I don't care. They're strawberries, nonetheless, and the pound cake looks delicious. I also got a huge chocolate ice cream, because uh, I wanted it. Uh, Steve also got the Snickers pound cake and got the chocolate fritters. Yeah. Okay, so we're at the Versus Game Show. This is the Spinnaker Lounge. We have a Jara from Colombia. On the Jara. Well, we didn't get picked for the versus game show, but that was okay because we were exhausted, <laughs> full and happy. So we called it a night and went to bed. It was an all in all great day aboard the ship. We had a wonderful time. The excursion was a wee bit disappointing, but we made the best of it and we had a great time with Roger and Christine. If they hadn't been there, it might have been a lot worse. <laughs> 
So thanks, Roger and Christine, for uh, coming along with us. And we'd like to invite all of you now to subscribe, like, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss out. And join us next time for our escape to St. Thomas. We're going to be visiting the St. Thomas Sky Ride and taking a lift to the top. We're going to drink some bushwhackers and take in the views. So come along and escape with us to St. Thomas next week.